listen, I'm sure you've heard this before. I know I have. Diamonds come from coal under pressure and through time, right? Anytime you feel stressed or pressured, you know, people talk about, well, that's how a diamond's made. It's made under pressure and for an extended period of time. And it's become really cliche, right? It's something you don't want to hear again because you've heard it so many times and it's like, well, does that really move me in any direction? But here is the fact of the matter. You and I, if we're pursuing any kind of great achievement in our lives or just want to live extraordinary, full and fun lives, we'll face challenges. We will face obstacles. We will come up against adversity that seems very challenging to overcome or to break through or to do the next thing because we're being held back or weighed down or stuck by these challenges and, and things in our lives that just naturally happen in the course of a human being's life. Here's my encouragement to you. My encouragement to you is that that cliche, as much as it's cliche, as much as you've probably heard it a thousand times, is absolutely true. If you realize, if you can appreciate that the challenges, the discipline, the struggles in your life are simply creating you, constructing you, building you up to become the kind of person that can handle anything, then that totally shifts your outlook on the challenges that you face. It totally shifts your perception and your attitude and your mindset when you come up to an obstacle, when you have a challenge that you have to overcome or find a way around or through or over, whatever it is, you know that you can take it on. And not only can you take it on, you want to take it on. You want to take on these challenges. You want to work through these challenges. You embrace and encourage and you're inspired by these challenges of life in your pursuit of excellence, in your pursuit of achievement and success, whatever that looks like for you, because you recognize that that challenge, that discipline, that adversity is constructing you and helping to build you into that person that you need to be to live the life that you want to live. I don't always bring in the word of the Bible, but I think this is vitally important. Whether you're religious or not, listen to this because I know it can be encouragement for you as you face challenges. Very quickly, as I lost my place, Hebrews 12, 11. No discipline, listen, no discipline seems pleasant at the time, but painful. Later on, However, it produces a harvest of righteousness and peace for those who have been trained by it. One more time. Listen to this. No discipline seems pleasant at the time, but painful. Later on, however, it produces a harvest of righteousness and peace for those who have been trained by it. What does that mean for you? What does that mean for me? What does that mean for anybody who's pursuing any kind of excellence or achievement or success in your life? It means that these challenges train us to become the person that we have to become, that we need to become to live the kind of life that we want to live, period. So here's the perspective. Here's the takeaway for you with this video. Going forward, when you face challenges, when you have discipline either forced upon you or you have to discipline yourself to get something done, smile. Be encouraged by it. Feel encouraged and inspired that this challenge that you're facing, this adversity that you're facing, these struggles that you're working through right now today are simply and foremost preparing you to live the extraordinary life that you want to live going forward. Because if you choose to stop in the face of adversity, if you choose to stop in the face of challenge, you choose to not do the things you need to be disciplined to get yourself to do to produce certain results in your life, if you don't do those things, you won't live the life that you want to live. You won't have the things. You won't become that kind of person because ultimately we are shaped, we are trained by our actions. And the times that we're trained and sharpened the most in life is when we're working through those challenges, when we're working through those struggles. So listen, I just want to encourage you, and I'll wrap up here in less than 30 seconds. If you're going through a challenge, if you're facing struggle, keep going. Smile, put on a happy attitude, put on a great attitude, be encouraged that challenge means growth. And growth is what pushes us to become the best kind of person we need to be in order to live the best kind of life that we want to live. I hope you're encouraged by that. I hope you go after your dreams and your success, whatever that looks like for you. No matter what, have fun, be awesome. Stay tuned, subscribe if you want to get further videos from me on a regular basis that come out weekly. And uh, let me know, comment, 
find me on other social media. I'm really happy to help you out however I can. If you can shoot me a message, let me know what you are working on. I'll get back to you very quickly. and We can set up a chat or just message quickly back and forth and uh, stay in touch and find out how I can help you to break through to whatever level of success that you are pursuing. Enjoy life. Have fun.